Guys, after literally three hours of queuing, I am finally in Overwatch 2. And honestly, this menu looks kind of sick. Holy crap. All right. They're really trying to sell that maximum tier skin. And in this video, guys, we're going to be getting the battle pass all the way to level 80 and checking out all the brand new items. I'm also definitely going to be posting a bunch of Overwatch 2 on this channel over the next few weeks. So make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss any of that. But all right, without further ado, let's go to the battle pass and let's get it to max level. All right, we got all those Overwatch coins. This game just got very expensive. All right, let's unlock all the tiers. There we go. We got to go higher. Yep, 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 yep. Looking good. Zenyatta voice lines. How do I? Yep, buy tiers. Give me it all. Well, I got to buy more currency? I just spent 150 bucks. Holy crap. Jesus. All right, 59 tiers. Let's do it. God, we've done it. We've got the maximum battle pass level. Okay, let's go check everything out. Yep, there they all are. Oh my God. Oh, my accountant is not going to be happy. Yep. All right, there we go. McCree looks cool. I'm keen to actually look at everything properly. And there we go. Maximum level battle pass complete. Ooh, we got prestige tiers. They honestly look... Can I buy prestige tiers? All right, here we go. Level one, obviously. You got Winston. You've also got a pretty sick diva skin. That is that is actually awesome. I'm glad to see that at least the skins seem to actually be true legendary skins. Sometimes battle passes, they, they put the crap in the battle pass. But this actually looks cool. We got a little thing there. We got an XP boost. Oh, player icons. What would we do without them? All right, we got name cards. I... We didn't have them in Overwatch 1. All right, cool. New features. You can be improved. Okay, we got Moira just being sassy as always. We've got, okay. He's eating a cookie. That doesn't really seem on brand, but we'll go with it. All right, what's May's emote? Ah, oh, okay, that's actually pretty adorable. But then again, everything May does is adorable. What do we got next? Winston spray. We've got, is that? Oh, it's a souvenir. I was like, is that a back bling? This isn't Fortnite. This is Overwatch 2. You attach that to your gun. Somebody has to stand up for the people. All right, Lucio just doing standard Lucio things. Honestly, this is probably the least cool skin that we've seen so far. I guess it is only epic. It's not like every single skin can be some crazy legendary. We got more player icons, don't care. More name cards, which I kind of actually do care about, but only because they're new. All right, here we go, Soldier 76. Highlight intro. Yep, we're gonna equip that one. It looks good. Okay, you can actually see the player models do look better. I literally don't even recognize that Soldier 76. All right, sprays, fantastic. More weapon charms, love to see it. Oh, okay, I guess you actually, you don't, I don't know what you do with souvenirs, but they definitely don't attach to your gun because that's, that's a weapon charm. I guess I'll find out. You come to more Muselk for all the Overwatch 2 information. Clearly, I know what I'm talking about. All right, next one. Victory pose. Yep. I mean, that's kind of on brand. I like it. We got sprays, name cards. Perhaps we Zenyatta. only exist in the memory of a person now gone. Perhaps we only I'm... exist in the memory. You know what? I don't really know what he means by that, but it's Zenyatta, so I'm Perhaps all here for it. For those of you who haven't seen me play Overwatch, Zenyatta is my boy, and I will be grinding competitive with him. All right, we got a Hinatori legendary skin. Actually looks pretty sick. We're going to equip that. I'm really keen to give her a go. I always love the idea of supports that can also deal damage, and she gives me big Zenyatta vibes. Like the kunai really reminds me of Zenyatta, where you're healing, but you're also kind of a threat. Next up, yep, more player icons, more sprays, another souvenir to put on my weapons. I'm all for that. I really wonder, like, are you going to be able to attach souvenirs to, I don't know, like Zenyatta? Like, he doesn't have a gun. I don't really get how that's going to work. Wait, no, again, souvenirs. I still don't know where they attach. That's not a weapon charm. All right. Victory pose, translocator. Very cool. Wait till you see me on my bike. Okay. Is she going to get, like, a, a bike add-on? When is the cinematic trailer for her going to drop as well? Because that's been teased a ton. And I thought it was out, but I couldn't find it anywhere. All right, here we go. We got a new emote. Oh, hell yeah. Just dancing. Looking good. Him and Lucio definitely could vibe together. Okay. Sprays. Lion. 
Name cards. Watch your step. It's a long way down. Okay, Hanzo being edgy as always. We love to see it. Commando. We're kind of, we're making progress here. We're moving through. Player icons, don't care. Sprays, don't care. Highlight intros with Tracer. Yes, I like that one. That's actually a great highlight intro. Give me that. Quip. This is my neck of the woods. McCree, sound and edgy as always. Yeah, I... I mean, I guess that's kind of a cool victory pose. I feel like I give more credit to the skin looking cool here than I do the victory pose, but whatever. Victory poses, I feel like all the OG Overwatch 1 victory poses were already so cool that the new ones, I don't know. I'm really curious to see if at a high tier, we're going to get animated name cards because most games do that. And if they're not in the game yet, they're definitely going to end up being it's in the game. It's all connected. Again, voice lines that just don't really mean anything to me. Oh, Beast Hunter. Hell yes. Equip that. All right, what else we got? Souvenirs. Victory poses. Moira just trying to look intelligent. High tech, low tech. We all die in the end. I don't really know what to make of any of these voice lines. I feel like they just mashed random words together for some of them. I swear to God, half the voice lines in Overwatch make no sense. All right. Yes, Junkrat. The king. Ah. Oh. Incredible, incredible, fantastic. I, I really just never have any complaint. If it's Junkrat <sighs> or Zenyatta, it's good. You are parts and I am whole. Okay, okay, very interesting. Oh, that is an amazing Mercy skin. Okay, I gotta say the legendaries they put in this battle pass are genuinely insane. Like. These are sick. I love this. This is awesome. I mean, I don't really play that much Mercy, but Mercy's my like, if I'm just like chilling with friends and I don't really want to like focus too much on what I'm doing, Mercy's great. All right. We got sprays, player icons. I wonder if they can do lobby music. We got a highlight intro for D.Va. Yep. I mean, I kind of like that. Again, I don't know if it's as... I feel like highlight intros and victory poses. Overwatch 1 victory poses and highlights These are so good. They don't stand a chance. Again, a, just... A, the voice lines are like nothing to me. Ooh, okay. We got a weapon charm. I, I really want to know how these are going to be attached to people who kind of like... like her she throws kunais are they just going to be attached to every kunai i really get it uh, especially zenyatta that's the one i'm confused about all right we've got a teaser for the tier 80 skin which is genji we've got okay yeah you can see these are epic name cards i bet you legendary name cards are animated i genuinely haven't spoiled the battle pass for myself so i don't know if there's going to be an animated legendary the name dragon card. and i are one yep all right you know what i'm sold on that the one. Oh no i unequipped touche that's the, the dragon best. and I oh, are I'll one. Later. All right. Hologram. Honestly, I, I said that all the best victory poses were out there, but the idea of Roadhog being super confused by a hologram kind of does it for me. Okay. Sky Centurion. Again, I'm here for it. I will equip that. We've got player icons again. I run with blades all the time. Here it goes. Sure. I'll equip you. Just a blue name card. And... Honestly, any emote that is just the character sitting there chilling, doing nothing, they're the ones that really do it for me. And Hanzo eating sushi, I'm definitely here for that. That is that is a great emote. Okay, literally, it's like emotes and skins are definitely the most value you're getting from these. Ooh, all right. Victory pose, again, pretty generic. That could have been a default one, but whatever. Ooh, I do love neon. We got another souvenir. We got a player icon. Yo, okay, this McCree skin. I love my gambler skin, but this one does look awesome. We're equipping that. And now for the final page, page number eight. There's still no leg legendary like player banners. That's interesting. Spray, don't care. Icon, don't care. I do not cower in the presence of evil. Arissa, badass as always. More souvenirs. Okay, we got to equip that. Wait, how do I... I'm going to figure that out later. All right. Sprays. We got a victory pose. Um, you know what? Actually, that's pretty good. I don't think I have that many good victory poses for her. We've also got a highlight intro. Okay, that's a good highlight intro. That is a sick... Okay, I was talking a lot of crap on the highlight intros. I take it back. That is cool. 
I will equip you. And all right, synth wave. Yep, we're going to equip that highest tier. And here we go. The tier 80 skin, which is Cyber Demon Genji. And honestly, oh, look, and we get a spray for it as well. Okay, yep, got to equip that. A Cyber Demon player icon. I just got to flex the max tier, you know? I got to show everyone that I'm an idiot. And here's the coolest part about this. If you didn't know already, the way they're doing these mythic tier skins for Overwatch 2 is... I don't. I think this is going to be the case for all of them. You can customize different elements of the skin. So you can see the weapon there on his back changes when I go between those two. I think that's definitely the best one. You can change the tattoo between these three. I feel like the default is definitely better. You can change the mask. Oh, it's between this and the first one. This second one kind of looks derpy. I don't know. I don't know about you guys. That one looks kind of derpy to me. I think I'm going to keep the default for those three. And then what do we got? That color scheme. This color scheme. Ooh. I mean, I feel like the first one's cooler. But I'm going to go with this. I can't just equip the defaults. And once you've reached the maximum tier, you also then unlock prestige things. Again, I, I believe that just changes the name tag that you get. So if you get all the way to level 200, you get Cyber Demon as your name tag, which I kind of like. That, I believe, is everything new in this battle pass. Maxed all the way to the top level. I'm going to jump in game. I'm going to see what else I can do. I'm going to see how else I can waste my money. We've got Undead McCree. You know what? I think I'm done uh, spending money for now. I think uh, I think I've I've done a pretty good job. I've given Blizzard I've given Blizzard all the money that they need for today. And uh, all right, guys, that was the Overwatch 2 Battle Pass. Make sure you hit subscribe on more Muzelk if you want to see more Overwatch 2 content. I'm definitely gonna be posting over the next little while, so stay tuned for that. But as always, thank you for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye bye.